guys, Sophie here, and today I'm going to show you some very special teas, and in particular, I'm going to show you something that will really help you with inflammation. Alright, so as you probably know, I'm obsessed with teas. I drink a lot of tea, black and green and white and oolong, and all those teas are slightly caffeinated but very healthy, filled with polyphenols, which are very potent antioxidants. So really good news, please everybody at home try and drink as many of those teas as you can. But there's another class of teas which are actually theoretically herbal tisanes or herbal infusions, and they're made just with herbs. Now there's this company that I found which is called Loose Leaf Teas Market and they have the most extraordinary blends. They really caught my eye so I wanted to show them to you. And the first one that I want to show is the Inflammation Blend. And when I first heard of this I thought, really? Inflammation blend in a tea? And then I got to know and understand this tea from a sort of herbalist perspective and, and it's really pretty uh, amazing. So um, a lot of us suffer from inflammation, may not even know it. Uh, it seems to be a disease of our time, chronic inflammation from a poor diet and from stress. This can show up in a myriad of different ways in your body. It can affect your digestive system, it can affect your skin. By if you're very, very super sensitive, red, rosacea, inflamed skin, that's one uh, manifestation. It could be psoriasis, it could be, uh, it really does tend to show up in skin. But then of course, you may have inflammation and have nothing going on with your skin. So as a sort of um, insurance policy, aside from changing your diet, which is important, and I write a lot about that, please visit my blog because I've got loads of blogs on that and other videos. But aside from that, um, why not drink a tea every single day, just a beautiful, soothing tasting tea that actually is going to help you with your inflammation by way of very specific herbs that have been added to the formulation. So this one here is is the Inflammation Relief Tea. Links are underneath this video. Now, key ingredients for me, or key herbs in this, are Tulsi, which is um, a very, very powerful herb, um, if you like. Amazing for inflammation and also for stress relief. Most people don't know that, but if you're really stressed out, Tulsi, also known as holy basil or holy basil, is something that you might want to start looking at including in your uh, in supplementation form. But a great way to have it instead of buying expensive supplements is in a tea. And also in this inflammation relief tea, there are, there's cal calendula, which is um, very soothing. There is ginger, which is great for inflammation. And there is a host of other. In fact, I haven't got my glasses on, but I'm going to see there's a bunch. There's about six or seven carefully selected and blended herbs that will help you with this. Now, what I've done here is I've infused it here with boiling water in my little teapot for about three or four minutes. If you want it stronger, obviously you do a little bit longer. If you want a very weak tea, a minute or so will do it. And then I'm just going to show you what this looks like. I wish you could smell it because it smells so good. There's peppermint in it as well. And it just smells lovely. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to, to sip this. Mm. Oh my gosh, that is so tasty so soothing, delicious. And actually what I might do um, sometimes is just put a drop of raw honey in it to give it a little pep up the sweetness. Loads and loads of other teas in this line. Um, what I have here is the um, Sleek and Slender, uh, which isn't, I'm not huge in these, you have to be very careful with these, all these weight loss teas that are, that are thrown out there, that a lot of them are complete nonsense and sometimes actually quite dangerous. But this one is the real thing. They've chosen um, a selection of different herbs in here that really can assist with that uh, sort of weight loss support or maintaining your healthy weight. Then we have uh, Wild and Weedy, and it says herbal support for kidneys, lymph, 
and skin. So anything that helps to assist cleansing my lymphatic system, I'm on with. And you could get a selection of these and drink different ones every single day. And then the Joyful Garden, which is uplifting and calming. And it has some of my favorite herbs in that one, including uh, lemon balm. Um, but lots of other teas um, in this line. Do check them out because I think you're going to be very, very taken with these. Um, and I'm going to leave you sipping my tea. Um, go and put on the kettle and make yourself a cup of tea. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel and please guys do leave me comments and leave me any questions that you want to about teas, about how long to brew them for, about temperature to brew them. I do know quite a lot about tea because it's been an obsession, a hobby of mine for the last 15 years. So any questions I would be more than happy to answer and I will see you next time.